Susan Boyle is one of the biggest success stories in talent show history. From an unknown woman from a, sco a small Scottish village to a multi-million album-selling singer, she became the poster girl for Don't Judge a Book by its cover. And it all began on Britain's Got Talent 11 years ago. Really high to get yeah, on Yeah, they are. <laughs> if I get a nosebleed, I'll know why. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Susan. I can't believe this is your first time on Loose Women. I sang in Loose Women. That's right. I have yeah. the pleasure of meeting the panel before. Oh, well, no, the pleasure's ours. I got goosebumps watching that. How do you feel looking back at those, you know, this, those were the moments that changed your life? See that frock? What was it like? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, somebody must have made that for me. <laughs> I could defend it now. Could defend it now. <laughs> I mean, obviously, you would never have known that that was the moment that your life would completely change direction. What were you thinking when you walked out on stage and faced that panel? Well, it was a mixture of uh, being downright cheeky because I had had auditions before. You know, auditions are like you know, mm -hmm. scrutinise everything, and I just uh, thought I'd have a good laugh with this. Yeah. And of course, I spotted up my pal, Piers Morgan. <laughs> <laughs> so I went... <laughs> Come here! <laughs> You've got a nickname for him, haven't you? Can I say it here? Yeah. yeah. It's not the same one I've got for him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, watch it, he's a nice guy. <laughs> I call him Piersy Baby. Aye. Oh. Have you got a wee crush? Crush? I think I've got a smash. <laughs> Oh, that says it all then. <laughs> what was you your... be sending him a Valentine's card then. Oh, no, it's me. It takes the... That takes all the goodness out of it. <laughs> it's going to be secret, you know. <laughs> now, you are... You're going to be going out on the road with what's called the, the 10 tour. To basically celebrate, obviously, it's been, you know, an amazing 10 years since uh -huh. taking part in Britain's Got Talent. What can people expect when they come and see you? I can expect a few new, new songs. I'm going to get them all up dancing, you know? Yes. Great. <laughs> More than that, I won't say. You know? <laughs> Get them all dancing to some new songs and some songs that they know from the albums, obviously, yeah. you know, and a better rock and no one, you know. And who's I'm the chap that you're doing the tour with, Susan? Or is he just guesting for some of the numbers? Is it Jai? Jai McDowell. Right. Nobody know him, no? <laughs> he won, he won what? There he is, there he is. He's, he's a smashing he, guy, he is. Yeah. He's a smashing guy, yeah, he really is. Mm. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I won. <laughs> so are you up dancing? I mean, do you actually do dance routines in the in the show as well? I do a couple of dance routines, you know. Yeah. Just, you know, giggle about a bit, you know. Good for you. And I've heard that you also have aspirations, or indeed you have done some um, acting. You would quite like to further your career as an actress as well. Is that well, right? Well, I've done a couple of the couple of films. The Christmas Candle been one of them, and I'd like to break into acting maybe later on. Yeah. And on this tour, it's a, it's a lovely size because you'll be able to be a bit more intimate with your audience and be able to have a chat and stuff. Do you get interactive with your audiences? And, well, and it's just like being in your front room. Yeah. You know? That's the kind of intimacy I would like because it's, I don't want it to seem to somebody that's going to be just above their audience or stuff yeah. like that. You just yeah. like to get down there and see. If you've got the one in the front row, doesn't he like you, for arms? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just came here to see what you were like, you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Susan, you've, um, you've done a few duets with people in the past. Is mm -hmm. there anybody that you're still looking to do a duet with or you'd like to do, just do a little turn with? I'd love to do a Michael Bublé. Oh. Okay. Yeah, lots of women me. would like to do my <laughs> yeah, <that's laughs> <like it>. <laughs> 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 To be fair. <laughs> Be careful what I said there, eh? <laughs> well, Denise knows Justin Timberlake, so you never know. <laughs> yes, I go. did um, bump into him last night in a, uh, in a restaurant. I was name-dropping today, wasn't I? Yeah, yeah. Yes, he was absolutely lovely. Yeah, that's good. But, um, but Susan, um, how did you... I want to know how your family reacted to your fame, because you went from leading such a kind of a normal, regular life to being 650 million hits on YouTube. I mean, that's unbelievable. Mm. Um, two Grammy nominations. W what has been their, their reaction? Because I know you've stayed very grounded. You still own the same house in, in, in Scotland. Is that, is that all correct information? That's all correct information. My, my family got on well, you know. They got on well, my family. That's what keeps me grounded. Because yeah. they love you and they're so, and they're so proud of you. I'm very supportive and I'm very proud. Mm. And obviously it's Valentine's Day, so we do have to pry a little bit and see if there's anybody 
special in your life? <laughs> I knew that was coming. <laughs> Is there? No saying. Oh! 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 No. <laughs> it was somebody once we had the, the sense to end the relationship, I think. Oh. Was that the doctor? That the doctor? Yeah. Uh, doctor who? <laughs> <laughs> but it said I, I read that you, you met him, you went for a spa day to treat yourself and you met this lovely dishy doctor and you disappeared with him and everybody thought that you'd, I'd been kidnapped. You'd been kidnapped. <laughs> <laughs> and the only I'm the only when I come back I smile on my face. <laughs> Where did you go? Aha, let me tell him. <laughs> <laughs> What's that in this bar, Dave? What's it, darling? <laughs> Let's just see you love me up the right way. No, brilliant. Subo! Subo! Anything else that you've got? To, you've done so much. Have you got anything else that you want to tick off of your list of things to still do? Oh, I'm still. Uh, okay, I'm nearly sixty, but that doesn't mean you have to stop. Yeah. It's life an old bird yet, you know. That's right. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> but you might like to learn to drive and learn to drive. Yeah. Two lessons. She's still a nervous wreck. <laughs> <laughs> I managed to steer the car in a straight line. Well done. <laughs> That's <all right. laughs> Really good start Everybody's got to start somewhere. That's oh, right. no, I know. And, and okay. your, your tour starts on the uh, the first of March <laughs> in Edinburgh. Please don't leave it so long to come back on the show. We've absolutely loved having you on. It's Susan Warren, everyone. Yeah.